啦啦。Hello, peeps. Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Welcome back to Smugly, where、um, we have got through the emergency. We didn't do terribly well, three out of seven, <laughs> but that's okay because look at all the money we now have. We also、um, completed the research for twenty thousand. We got some nice publicity points,、um, and we have now started to work on the X-ray. So I thought what we would、uh, do now. Is、uh, build the surgery. I think that we will start trying to get the surgery running. It's not going to run very well,、um, but at least it will、um, bring us in money, right?、Um, it's it's going to bring us in money. So let's、um, build. Let's let's build this room、uh, now. Which way do I want? Which way do I want it? Should we put the door? Like this, I think so, and then they can come in and get changed like they do, and then we can put the operating theatre here.、Uh, I think、uh, maybe like that. We can put the sink where they clean themselves back here. So this can be their sort of space, can't it? Sort of the office type space then. That we have、um, now. There's quite there's, there's a few things here, isn't there? We've got this、uh, operation monitor,、um, which is plus two treatment power. Look at that. So if we unlock this, how much is it? Nine thousand. It's quite expensive, isn't it? But I think I think it's probably a good idea to have it.、Um, to be honest. Probably a good idea to have it. There we go.、Um, I like these X-ray boards, so I think we might pop one there. That might be nice. And pop one.、Um, don't know.、Let's、see, would that go? Go on that wall? It would go on that wall. It's a little bit weird on that wall, perhaps. Might put it there. Might put it there. <sighs> Um, because we would like to get some medicine cabinets in, although right next to the window, I don't know if I want them right next to the window. Maybe we could put them here, because again, they've got some treatment power in them,、uh, which is always nice.、Um, and I do also kind of like the idea of having this nearby. There we go. This medicine cabinet's. In the right place, is it? There we go. Maybe we should leave this more central. I don't know. It's tricky to know、um, where I sort of prefer this. Now, fire extinguisher isn't really needed in this room, I don't think.、Um, I mean, it's here and recommended. But if we build it, they're operating. None of this stuff requires maintenance. So. I don't really feel like it's necessary, even though it's on recommended. I don't know. Seems a bit confusing to me.、Um, now, do you know? This is probably. I mean, it's built in. You can see they've got some built in to the sink.、Um, but it just makes sense. It feels like it's the right thing to do <laughs> to me.、It、just feels like it's the right thing to do.、Um, to be honest,、um, I think we might pop a cupboard in. Just here.、Um, now the thing is, is that really、uh, we should put in the stuff for、um, idling as well, which seems a little bit weird to be putting a sweet dispenser、um, in a surgery. <laughs> But、um, it, it kind of needs to go in there, you know, because they will idle, they will get hungry, and that will deal with it. It will help. So I'm gonna do it.、Uh, let's pop a chair over here.、Um, a certificate, just so that they've watched ER. There we go.、Um, yeah. So I think here it is. Here is here is our surgery.、Um, how warm is it over here? It's, it's, it's actually alright. Oh, but we don't actually have a radiator in here. Okay, fair enough. Let's、um, see if we can just fit a nice. There we go. 
But, I mean, that's that's pretty good. Uh, what if we put that over here and then perhaps just plopped a small radiator? Are you not? What's going on? <laughs> Under here. What's that like? Hopefully that'll be all right and not too warm. I mean, we'll see. It's getting a little bit red there. We'll see how they how they feel about it. Uh, we'll pop a Benny down here. Do you know what? We probably should pop a couple down. I I've got a feeling we're going to have too many people showing up here. Um, you know, I, I do feel like that's going to happen. Um, with the game's paused just at the moment. I try and keep people happy with these bits and bobs. There we go. Just try and try our best here. Just try and keep them happy. Um, and for some mild entertainment, nothing crazy, we'll pop those down. Um, yeah. Okay. So let's unpause it again. Now, the staff that we have some at the moment. A meteorite has been spotted streaming through the sky. Oh, let's get them working in surgery. Right there we go. Just kidding. It's actually headed to the county right next to us. And take them so out of working in nice fluid analysis. Okay. And let's see if we can start working on some surgeries over there. Uh, we could do. with training them up so if we train them up in ghost capture okay um that might be quite nice i think um because we're going to want to replace this person so time to start working on that now that we've got some money coming in um and we do have money coming in now we're in a situation where the hostel is is making money um and what we want to do here is not expand too quickly what we need to try and do now is get the hostel into a situation where it's it, it's running what it has better now that it's earning money we need this to function better here, this is a, a big problem for us um both our ghost hunters are in there. Um, so we know that we really do want a new GP. There is one right there. So, I mean, that's fantastic. That was really lucky. So we now have three GPs, two GP offices. Um, so they will always be... Yeah, and they are travelling over to here as well for the toilet, which is mighty annoying. Mighty annoying indeed. Because Dan Vape here is now going to head back to that middle building. It's an awful lot of walking around for the toilet that's happening here. So, stay here instead and go for treatment. Um, I think that might be better. Doctor to head office. Okay. Um, you are very low on health. You can go home. So that was a psychiatry. That was interesting. Okay. Um, and why are we going to a situation where we have such a huge queue here? I suppose it is the only way of... Well, no, it isn't the only way to diagnose, is it? We've got the ward. Um, but the x-ray is coming, and I think it's the x-ray that I like the I the idea of. I think it's x-ray that uh, I'm going to be keen to, to build next for further diagnostics. Um, let's see, we've got... A lot of people here that are quite low in health. Let's not do it this way. This is a silly way of doing it. Um, you're already getting cured. 
I think we'll send you home. Send you home. Send you home. I think we'll send these guys home as well because they're in that queue. Because they're already in there. Okay. How's happiness? Happiness is alright. Buy your tickets now. And don't forget to bring your credit cards. Uh, let's see if we just get some people out of this queue. This is two point radio. Just try and help it a little bit. Fracture ward. Fracture ward is um is an interesting one, isn't it? Is. It it is. Um I'm starting to like the idea of the fracture ward. Um, because we're always looking to make more money. <laughs> But I am also concerned about the fact that we're heading up to level 8. I like the idea of trying to train up our GPs. But look, maybe we're not making quite enough money yet. If we look at illnesses. Where would we get bang for our buck? Actually, possibly psychiatry. Easier to set up. Much cheaper to set up. Doesn't need as much staff. And we're getting actually about the same in a return for less input which excites me <laughs> and we could build it here you know we don't we don't have to set up a new building for it which is you know really fantastic ooh doctors so yeah kind of like that kind of like that and there's we could move because the x-ray is going to be coming but we're not going to have the room to build it x-ray is quite big we won't have the room we won't have the room to build it um and really to be honest it's the mega scan that i'm after so once we've done the x-ray we probably won't build it we probably will just start heading straight for that mega scan um to be honest uh i are you gonna make it? I don't know. Oh, your health is quite low. Don't know if you're gonna make it, to be honest. I think we could afford to train um, a GP2. Um, do we want to risk trying to train two of them? Might create some cues, but I think we might just do it. Um, I think we will just do it. I think we might send you home. Uh, excellent. Doctor needed in GP's okay. office. slightly better order patient has refused to pay so this is the thing and it's only it's only 10 higher um, so what we're going to do is that instead um, bring this price reputation up it'll also help increase our reputation but it might actually start helping bringing in more money um, you know Nurse to fluid analysis. I think that's what we're going to do Marjorie dill pickle sends us today's nice words of the day which are if you are confident, everything else will follow. That's right, Marjorie. Including old age and death. <laughs> I'm confident of that. Okay. Charming. Okay. Alright, they're learning their GP. He's got seven. I, d I just don't know if this is going to happen. It looks like he's been kicked out at some point. Like, he was in there. And now he's not in there, which is very odd. I wonder how far through that surgery they are. I'm not sure. Oh, he's sewing up. Okay. X-ray unlocked. Fantastic. 18,000. And he died. Um, three health. Maintenance announcement. Toilets need routine servicing. Okay. Two health. <laughs> I 
Well, he shouldn't need to get changed. He should just be able to get straight on the table. He's st still going to get changed. I don't know why that's happened. It's very odd. Right. Okay. So, x-ray done. Um, yes, the mega scan. There it is. With the discovery of x-rays, sometimes scientists have speculated on the possibility existence of Y rays. Clearly that's absurd, idiots. Let's design a massive magnet and see if it's useful for something. <laughs> so we're going to start that one. That's I'm very interested in that. Um, it should be quite a powerful diagnostic tool for surgeries, uh, really, uh, more than anything. Uh, I'm pretty sure that it is. I'm still sort of trying to learn which diagnosis rooms work well for, for what. Um, X-ray I think is quite good for fracture, uh, which sort of makes sense. Um, but I think really it's the mega scan that's quite good for this, um, you know, which I suppose does make sense as well. Maintenance needed in staff room. Maintenance needed in staff room. I find this bizarre. So, oh, hello. Oh, one's, one's through. One's through the training. Oh, that's that's a point. Are you ready for training? No, damn it. That's a shame. And there we are. Promote them. Now, do we have a psychiatrist? No. What we could do... Uh, I think we might train them up. We're gonna have to wait for this GP to finish though. Oh, it's the award ceremony time. Fantastic. What is Zoe? Right, I'm thinking Zoe can be a psychiatrist. Um, and that will be an additional income and then we really are cooking with gas, I would say. We will make a very quick, I think, one of these. Nothing too crazy. Um, I think we will use the rug. Because um, it can help, I think, with placing these things. This is Nigel Bickleworth. On Two Point Radio. Do not despair, radio aficionados. Your daily dose of worldliness and sophistication has arrived. I am Nigel Bickleworth, and this is Two Point Radio. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, do you know what? I could probably put. Oh, yeah. I like that. Oh, but well, I've started to get a bit carried away in here. I'm enjoying myself too much. Something's happening. <laughs> Actually, I don't know where I want to put that. Because uh, it's not quite fitting, is it? With all the garbage that's around. Okay. We might have to pop that here. We normally have our certificate here. I think we have to pop that there. Um, we will put radiator in because I know that we've got the fireplace and it does produce heat, but it doesn't produce a lot of heat, um, to be honest. Um, you know, it doesn't. Um, pop that in there. Excellent. Um, don't seem to have anywhere to put this. Doctor GP's office. That might have to do. There we go. There we go. Let's get some, I think, hmm, do you know, we'll put some bennies around this area. Um, do you know what, we might also stick a couple of bennies here. It seems like we've got a lot of people walking around. Let's uh, help them out a little bit. Okay. And 
Um, do you know what? I'm, I might put a bookcase here. Oh, let's see. What's going on here, everybody? Are you alright? No? You're never going to make it. That much I can tell you. Injection room, calling nurse. Uh, you seem like you're unlikely to make it as well. <laughs> turtle head emergency. Well, turtle head emergency um, sounds doable. Are you the... Probably are, and you're currently on break. That's good to know. I'll probably get that going in a minute. Now, what's happening with you? I think we might send you home. Um, yeah. Right. Let's get um, some bits and bobs in this area for everybody. Um, Penny. And do you know maybe we could have something to do for hygiene there, and uh, we'll get one of these in. Actually, can we fit two in there? Maybe. And then maybe a couple of magazine racks. Maybe we can pull that just a little bit closer. Doctor required in psychiatry. There we go. Right. There we go. What's going on with you? Maybe you could go home. We'll promote you and we'll promote you. Send them home. Now, are you back? Yeah. Is this your? I mean, you're good. That's repaired. Turbo plunger's been repaired. If you come off your break and now come in here, and I think what we're going to do is accept this emergency. That will be great. Um, you're. I don't think you're going to make. He's been called into the room. Okay. I was thinking he's probably not going to make it because after the emergency has been. But he's just going to go there straight now. So. It's the emergency people that are apparently going to have to wait. This is a terrible queue. I don't like this queue at all. Um, it's 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 a little bit annoying that queue, but it's under a lot of pressure. <laughs> I mean, it really is under a lot of pressure. Um, let's see here. So this GP still isn't ready for training. I can't believe it. Can't believe that at all. That seems terrible to me. Um, do you know what we might do is train them up in surgery too and look at this <laughs> we've not we've not done surgery training yet but look who it is it's dr. B pepper particularly skilled at dissection obsessed with fizzy drinks <laughs> reminder of anybody <laughs> let's start that training um, let's send them home that they're very low health in fact let's just go through the patients let's see if we can have just a little bit of a clear out um, I might send you home what are you on I mean that's quite a lot but they are all in this injection queue with the lowest health going so I don't know and they've not even got much diagnostics in place so I think we're just gonna do that Make, make it a little bit easier for ourselves. Um, no, can't cure that. Okay, it's not so bad. Not so bad. Sure, come along. Okay. So, we've got in B Pepper here. Oops. Oh, do you know what we could do? We could probably put our bookcases back. As the money is uh, calming down now. So, I mean, we're not... It could be better, but it's not outrageous anymore. And, um... Excellent, excellent. She's doing her thing! I feel it's my duty to warn you about the dangers of traveling abroad. All right. Not only will you encounter scoundrels who think nothing of pickpocketing your 19th century velvet wallet, but you will have to spend time at Grockle Falls Airport, a more ghastly place I cannot recall. Really? Okay. 
So what we're going to do with the mega scan and the injection and all that, we're going to look at buying this plot, I think. And this is the plot that we're going to do our further diagnostics in. Um, and in here we might build um, also uh, cardio and the general diagnosis. I think that's uh, what we, uh, with the GP office, uh, I think that's what we need to try and get over here um, to pull it out of this building so that we have more space for GPs and things like that. I think that will be really good. I think that's something we're going to be focusing on um, as, as our new sort of project um, moving forwards. But while constantly working on, on our foundations, um, but we clearly need to... Uh, to be better at diagnosing uh, people, but I, it is getting better. It just could be better still. Uh, but I suppose, to be honest, that's always true, isn't it? That's always going to be true. Um, let's move them to the top. Send them home. Um, you're in the toilet. Fair enough, fair enough. I'm wondering, with here, uh, let's see, in recommended. 10 grand but it could help just a bit of research power you know might be worth just trying to pop one in see if we can help her and maybe we could uh, get her um, to do a little bit of training how warm has that made that room because it's right by the radiator no it's alright okay that's fine good you know we could see about training her up in research a little bit more um, that wouldn't be terrible idea um, you need to go to the bottom let's get you out of this queue there's no need for you to be there you're probably the same really okay I've got a queue over here still let's move you to the top and you near the top uh, excellent uh, you could probably go floppy disks promote them I just don't think that we can. I just don't think that we can. How's all this going? Oh, she's she's fixing it. Hey, go for a break. Um, the doctor in here, he's okay. Let's just keep this going. Try and keep that going. We're curing more than we were, which is nice. Um, that is nice. Oh no. And this has um, become a further diagnostic tool as well. She's probably going to get swamped. Um, yes, yeah, she could be promoted. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button. As long as you are here, why not check out one of my delectable videos available? Feel free to come stalk me on social media and be sure to share this video with friends so even more may watch my shizwa. See you next time, peeps!